And just like any storm heading towards southeast Louisiana, one major threat from Sally is flooding in New Orleans, and that will put the city and the sewerage and water board to the test to keep the water draining. Mike Perlstein of our Down the Drain investigative team brings us this update on the city's preparations. Anticipating that Hurricane Sally could bring a storm surge as high as 11 feet and up to 20 inches of rain, New Orleans officials jumped into action Sunday to prepare for the worst. Mayor LaToya Cantrell has already announced an emergency declaration calling for a mandatory evacuation of all areas outside the levee system and extreme caution inside of them. Parking restrictions were lifted earlier this evening. Starting late Monday, residents are encouraged to stay off the streets and be prepared for power outages. But as with any threat of heavy rain, the capacity of the New Orleans Sewage and Water Board and its aging equipment is what makes many people nervous. The agency said it remains as prepared as possible, fully staffed and with all 99 drainage pumps working. But once again, the amount of self-generated power needed to operate those pumps takes up nearly all of the agency's entire capacity. And that means the loud portable generators, known as EMDs, will once again be counted on for frontline power generation, rather than as backups. As we've said many times, the loss of Turbine 5 in December of last year was a, a, a very critical loss for that power. There is adequate power to supply to the system in, in a backup capacity, but that loss, uh, you know, is an issue. But with several dress rehearsals throughout the summer and the surprise flooding from June 10th, Cantrell is declaring the city ready. We're as prepared as possible and understanding while living with it, a, a um, antiquated uh, drainage uh, system, it just requires us to do a little bit more, you know, due diligence to make sure that we're ready and we believe we are. Of course, our entire down the drain investigative team will continue to be on hand to monitor the situation. But for now, reporting from the Surgeon Water Board's main plant, Mike Perlstein, Eyewitness News. City officials urge anyone who wants to get updates on their cell phone to text Sally to 888-777.